Let's put the NFC West on the clock. Pete Prisco, Brian McFadden. Let's start with the Seattle Seahawks. There was talk they might go Sam Howell. There was talk they might go Malik Willis. What did you like what they eventually did do, Pete? Yeah, in some ways I did, but we keep hearing how they're going to try and evolve the offense a little bit and become more of a pass offense. And what do they do? They take a bunch of offensive linemen and a running back, Kenneth Walk- Ken Walker, in the second round. I don't get that. Uh, I mean, if you're going to evolve the offense, uh, you know, Charles Cross is a pass protector. I get that. That one makes sense. But then you go look and you, you say Abraham Lucas. I don't know about that one either, the tackle they picked in the third round. I understand they had to get better up front, but the running back... Uh, Ken Walker is a little bit of a surprise for me in the second round. So do I like the draft? I really like Kobe Bryant uh, and Tariq Woolen, the two corners they picked uh, in the fourth and fifth round. So I do like their draft. I just think they went in a different direction than I would have. I didn't like it at all. I gave them a C minus. And you know if I give you a C minus, you didn't do a good job. Wow. Based on some of the points that Pete hit on, you look at the offensive structure, when you don't have a franchise quarterback, you finally try to add pieces. They should have did this years ago when they had Russell Wilson. I love Cross. I think Cross would be a phenomenal player. But some of the other moves, Kenneth Walker, you got Rashad Penny, who came along strong a year ago. I understand he's under, what, a one-year deal. And then you still have Chris Carson, who you pay some money to. The only issue with Chris Carson has been durability. But when he's been healthy, he, Pete, he can go. So me personally, when you look at their division, and let's keep it real, they're in the midst of a rebuild. And they didn't start a they didn't start this rebuild off. Do you want a sports network that delivers everything that matters about the game? The highlights, the picks, the instant analysis, no yelling, no fake debates, no politics. Hit the subscribe button and never miss a moment.